Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenra, and today we are playing Bohemia here in Crusader Kings 2. This is the extension of the multiplayer game with Kaelvin and Arumba. Now, Kaelvin's dynasty is gone. There, there's nothing really left of it. Um, it does exist. Its name does exist. I'm sure we could find it somehow. Uh, if we go to, like, past kings of Navarro, we should be able to find it, right? History. Yeah, there you go. King Kelvin the first, and then Queen Ello. She had a niece, right? No. No. I thought she had a niece. No, they're all the wrong dynasty. Yeah, they're all the wrong dynasty. Well, I'm not sure if his dynasty still exists, but Arumba's does. She's just too old to have more babies. Babies. Uh, but we're going to go ahead and uh, see if we can't marry the kid over here. You know? <laughs> Why not? OMG daughter. Matrilineal. Sounds good to me. Let's get that knot tied up. And let's continue our war for Ungvar. Ungvar. It's the war for Ungvar. Can we catch them? Please tell me we catch them and kill them all. That would be great. Man, it takes forever to walk to these, to walk from here to there. Good, ah, he got away. Army. What? Then no uh, peace out with the liege. What? Your microphone sounds like crap. Sorry, but it's a fact. Yeah. No. I couldn't understand what you said. Something about piecing out. If you destroy their army, and they will piece out with their liege. Ah, I gotcha. I hear that. So we'll just seed him down. And our wife is currently having problems over here in Swabia. Swabia! That's going to be nice. I wonder if she realizes that she married a king and then her lands are going to go to my kids. That's going to be great. Whoa! Whoa! Aw, oh, man! King Ulrich of Francia usurped the title Duchy of Flanders. From Arumba's dynasty. Aw, oh, man. East Francia, you bastard. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Poor Arumba. Oh, stupid steward was hurt. He got a tithe and he was hurt? My brother had a kid. Okay. Sieges are finishing good. wonder how high we're going to have to get to take everything. Probably like 90%. I don't know. Still can't usurp Silesia, even though we own all of it. That's stupid. <laughs> That's really dumb. We are, however, getting a lot of money held up. How's Mr. Pope Man doing here? You still got cash? Yeah, he's got cash. Oh, the Pope is an imbecile. How did this guy become Pope? Look at this. 01008. Really? Who the hell voted for an imbecile? He's probably up there on his little Pope chair drooling all day long. What the hell? And there's a Cathar revolt over here. For whatever reason. We gotta go get rid of that damn Pope. God, he's dumb. Zero, one, zero, zero. Wow. 
At least he's just. Ah, oh, and we lost our war. God damn it. Oh well. Let's go kill these rebels. Rebels! Rebels? My nephew wants to be ambitious, but I don't think I want him to be ambitious. I kind of like the idea if we're going to be playing as an ambitious character, and currently if we die, we're going to we're going to be playing as this kid. But we're probably going to live long enough to make babies, and I think I'd rather make babies than rely on our nephew. So no ambition for our nephew. Sorry. No. Kill the rebels. Now this is something I don't understand. These are my rebels. These are my rebels and they're going into someone else's land. That doesn't make any sense. They're mine. They shouldn't be able to do this, but they do frequently. Stand everyone down. And what is going on? You have some weird war. What is this? Uh, defending against Duke Bulan of Slavonia. Slavonian Holy War for Pex. Uh, defending against Chief Rosit Rostilov of Lower Don in the Lower Donian League Independence War. And another Holy War for Pest. Oh, that's my duke. My duke is going on a holy war for pest. Really? Interesting. Okay. Well, why don't we attack Hungary then? You have any strong allies? No. Okay, what can we declare war on you for? We can go... You know, we can just go over here and take Ungvar. We were going to go to war for Ungvar anyway. I guess we might as well just do that. I want it. I want it. I want it willingly. Hope you guys know what that's from. You probably don't. That makes me sad in my pants. So we're at war. We'll wait a little bit for our troops to recover. And then we'll raise and go smash an army or go stand over there or whatever. No, I'm not going to peace out. That's a holy war. And that's going to make my people happy. Real happy. Thirteen K, that'll do. Okay, you morons meet up in Prague. And you morons meet up in Actually, why don't you guys go there? Yeah, you're closer. The northerners meet up in Prague. The southerners meet up in Vienna. County of Nassau. I don't want that. Really, I don't. Nassau. Whatever. I don't want the county. No. I want the Duchy of Bavaria, damn it. Our steward died. Oh, come on. Holy crap, we have some bad stewards in the realm. Uh, you want to be steward, though, so you'll at least get up to 13, but still. Come on, that's a pretty bad steward. Go collect taxes. Our old steward got injured collecting taxes, right? This guy was collecting taxes. He got injured while he was collecting, but he still got the tithe anyway. I didn't think it was possible to get the injured event and the tithe event at the same time, but they did at exactly the same time. Same day. It's weird. He's like, I got your money. Uh, it hurts. Apparently he wants to play. He's bringing 7,200 guys over here. Oh, my niece needs tutoring. Do I have room for tutoring? Nope. All right, well, I'll pan you off to um, somebody who doesn't like me. Well, they all like me. I'm a new king, and everyone already likes me. Why does everyone in the realm like us? Well, probably because we have 
28 diplomacy. It used to be 30, but then we got Roth. It used to be 30 diplomacy. Yeah, we, we had all green all green traits. Now we look at Roth. I didn't get Roth when we were king. Somebody else got Roth. Somebody else caused him to get Roth. But yeah, let's educate this girl with... I don't know. Sort by dynasty. Dynasty. Let's educate it by Shenner uh, 4. You can stutter all your, your wonderful tutorings to her. Group you guys up. And let's roll. Group you guys up. You need some leaders. There you go. There you go. And uh, he's coming over here, so we'll play. He's arriving on the 16th. We'll leave on the 15th. It'll be a party. OMG daughter is of legal age. Let's get married. Very good. Oh my god, we're losing horribly. Are you kidding? We're getting slaughtered. It's not even close. We have some bad generals. The horribleness of this battle is ridiculous. Oh, we are making him retreat a little bit. That'll help. His right flank just fell. Our center, our center just fell. And our right flank is going to fall. Wow, that did not go well, let me say. Uh, we do have more guys coming, so it'll be all right. Wow, we lost almost 5,000 men. Not a good start to the war. We'll just try again, right? What could possibly go wrong? Round two. Fight! There we go. Overwhelming numbers. We imprison some idiot. Oh, wow, he's a good marshal, isn't he? Well, it would be just horrible if someone were to execute your dumbass. Yeah. Oh, wow, look at you. You're, you're a very religious man. It would be just horrible if someone were to execute your dumbass. That's right. All right, let's take... Um, Wow, these armies are just t trashed. I think what we'll do is we'll drop our armies and re-raise. Because this is just wow. Caught someone else. No, I think we'll leave this guy alive. You want to have a three marshal guy leading your armies? You go for it. <laughs> That's a good, good, good plan there, my friend. Stop running back and forth, please. I want you to die. Ooh, my nephew wants to be a fatty. No, we'll make him temperate. No fatty nephew. Okay, this should kill him, right? This should be it. There we go. Yep, okay. Now go home. We'll stand you down, and then we'll siege out Ungvar. Just wait for this to get back up to like 12 or something. Long war is long. Well, we had Ungvar sieged already, but in a different war. Oh, the Pope died. Oh, no more idiot Pope. This guy's a little better, yeah. Ooh, alright, so we're already making... Oh god, he's in... He's... 
<laughs> just like daddy. So this is the heir to the Kingdom of Castile. This is the guy who's going to take over after Arumba's dynasty is gone. And uh, we matrilinely married him, so we're already making babies over there. And we can we can name them. That's that's cute. I think Udo is fine. No, we're, we're going to rename him. We're going to call him uh, uh, Usurper. There's no more Arumban dynasty. They're going to go to Shenplay's dynasty. and we can make this happen. Ah! Your experience in matters of war has increased, and there are many things you can do differently in future battles. What will you focus on? Rough terrain, cavalry, light foot, heavy infantry. Um, well, our retinue is cavalry, so let's do that. Oh, and these guys actually got independent. Well, why don't we just declare war on you then, Mr. Independent Man? What an idiot. I'm independent! How about war? No, not war. Okay, 11k, that's probably good enough. Isn't it fun being independent, having no one able to save your dumb ass? Like, wait, one, one second, let me swear fealty to someone new! No. Yeah, a little late there, my friend. Count Hartwig of Zenoimo is trying to usurp my title. Nah, just leave him alone. I don't care about Zenoimo. I do want to get that county eventually, but eh. Zenoimo. Seventy-four percent. You want peace yet? No. Wow. How did we get seventy-four percent though? Wow. It's impressive. You say impressive. I already know it. No, go away. What? Some other holy war? No. Ah, uh, my nephew wants to be a sloth. Hell no. You have to be diligent, my friend. If I'm going to take over as you, you're going to have good stats, okay? I know I told you not to be ambitious, but that's just kind of a self-preservation thing. Okay, hold on. There's 10,000 motherfuckers coming over here. Let's group you up. And give you some generals, if you don't mind. You as well. I'm even going to buy some mercenaries here. Someone who's not completely depleted. There we go. Alright. I'm just having a royal rumble.
Call to arms from Arumba. N no. Hey, we got a tithe. All right. Okay, well, we won that big battle. We killed 7,000 of them. Nice. All right, why don't we leave... We'll take these guys to go kill them off. Yeah. You guys split up and keep sieging. Great. And you're still running away. We'll just track you down, make you die. Still don't want peace, huh? Alright. Fair enough. I ain't the boss of you, I get it. Oh, we got there first. <laughs> and you all died. Great. We are out of time for this episode, though, so why don't we cut the video here? We'll come back next time for war. Well, Kumania joined. That's what. That, that's why that battle was so big. Yeah, war against all these idiots. We'll see you then. Have a good day.